It is the riot on Radio U, 8772 Radio U, if you want to text in. Last night, one of the ads during the Super Bowl that uh, it, it garnered a lot of attention, we can say that, mm-hmm. is the Uber Eats ad. You seem to not like it as much as I did. I didn't find it as funny, but the second I watched, I was like, oh yeah, they're going to give us a warning. Oh yeah. <laughs> they're yep. Telling that the is, to not do as the commercial did. That is what happened. So the Uber Eats ad, if you missed it last night, it is, uh, it's a a few people, uh, Jennifer Coolidge is one of them, Nicholas Braun, Trevor Noah, Gwyneth Paltrow is in it, and uh, they're all, they order stuff on Uber Eats, and the question is asked, if you order it on Uber Eats, does that mean I can eat it? Because they were promoting the fact that, you know, you could just get any sort of thing yeah. delivered at this point through Uber Eats, um, and so they, they were promoting that. They eat, uh, Gwyneth Paltrow eats one of her candles, and they're oh, the eating, diaper like, one dish too. sponge. Yeah. Oh, yeah, the diaper is bad. <laughs> Uh, the the pencil (laughs) sponges and uh and dish soap and Mm -hmm. so uh with that the united states consumer protect uh product safety commission felt the need to tweet out they just said simply do not eat soap that's the one (laughs) thing they had to warn us about Mm -hmm. is uh that we're not supposed to eat soap uh and but it i actually don't think the commercial is that bad you liked it. some people didn't like it you know what though I think I might like it in part because of the, and actually this would be probably be true about a lot of the commercials I liked last night. It's more that I like the people in them. Sure. Because I like the Larry David one for uh, for the crypto. You even like the though, Paul Rudd one. Yeah, right. Mm-hmm. Uh, the Idris Elba one, that was a hit. All the ones with people I like, and Jennifer Coolidge and uh, Nicholas Braun, Cousin Greg, they're both, they're goofy. They're just goofy people, or at least they're good at acting goofy. But you like that, but you got to re- realize um, I can be easily swayed. So what if I drink? Yeah, soap? that's right. <laughs> they're they're the being too goofy for too us goofy. dumb Americans, right? Yeah, but I, like I said, the second I saw the commercial, I was like, oh, yeah, someone's going to follow up with this to remind yeah, us not sure. to eat a candle. Well, the other funny thing about that commercial is that, uh, although I did like it, and it's a 30 second commercial, or I guess it's one minute, maybe. I don't know. But uh, either way, surprising that uh, even me liking it, it went on too long. Yeah. <laughs> like the point is getting has gotten across very quickly. And somehow the commercial just continues on and on and on. Well, I like someone's tweet about it. It's a rare combo of being a good ad that also makes me want to throw up. Yeah. <laughs> well, is it good, though? Because I'm not going to go order on Uber Eats. Well, at least For stuff that I'm going to eat or not eat. So. Yeah, that's all right. They, but it did get my attention. Listen, they understood they probably wouldn't get you anyways. <laughs> yeah, right. I, I'm not. It's, I'm hard to win over. What can you say? That is true. I have learned that this morning going oh, over the commercials yeah. from yesterday that Hudson... Very few did he enjoy it. it. Even if you enjoy it, does not mean you're going to oh, get into that's the item. Whatever. I'm not going to get crypto because I liked Larry David's commercial. You're tough. No. <laughs> <laughs> it's the riot. <laughs>